fightpress.nl. Daniel Ilunga. Wie geht's? Gut, 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 danke, danke. <laughs> That is my only German I can speak. We are here. Tomorrow you have to fight a big fight. Yes, sir. The last time it was a crazy fight. There was it, yes. There was a huge fight. Yes. Everybody was like, whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> Tomorrow, what do you expect of the game? Uh, tomorrow there will be fireworks like last time, but much more strategy and technical fights, clever fights, yes. Definitely. I spoke to your opponent, he also said the same. Um, he said he's going to bring it to you, but at the same time he's going to use his mind. Uh, what can you tell about your preparations, how did it go? Before you were training at Bonyanski, mm -hmm. now I think you stop there, you're back in your... Yeah, um, let's say I, I don't stop, but we're still in good contact, we still work sometime with Remy. Yes. But uh, this preparation, I've done it in Germany, yes. I've done much more boxing, and uh, I have a new trainer also, Gary Belbe from Cologne. He's uh, training, preparing me much more in direction of boxing. Yes. So, but um, the main point of this preparation was that the tactic, tactical fight. Tactic. Yes, we work on our, our strategy. And did you watch your old game? Not really, because on me, what happened is already happened. So I don't watch on it. So I just looking forward to what I'm gonna do next, so that's what I'm gonna do. Are you going for the knockout? Every fighter goes always for knockout, but uh, I'm not gonna force it. Yes. I'm gonna work on it, but I'm not gonna force it. Nice. Uh, if you would predict, first round, second round, third round, or you just say, I'm just going for the win, finish. I would say everyone will be a lot of pressure. We will do a lot of pressure, but technical pressure yeah I will work but very very clever so that's what I focus on it all the preparation just work hard and make pressure but clever pressure nice um, my parents come from Ghana your parents come from Congo DRC Congo um, there's a lot of things going on nowadays uh, what do you have to say about those things there's things that happen at the moment that hurt myself. Yes. Because I'm seeing what happened with our brothers, not from Congo, not from Ghana, from everywhere, that are traveling in some countries that yes. get into slavery. Yes. At this time, at this week, 2017, you see that still people are being selling, that people are being slavery, they hate and torture every day. Every day when we are fighting now, there's people that are suffering. So that's the thing that happened that hurts myself. Every time I see these videos, I get, I get, feel bad, very bad. Could you believe it when you saw it? No, no, definitely not. When I saw it the first time, I thought this may be an old movie. But since it starts, every day you see new and different places, different kind of torture. And all these people have family, friends and kids and that's very bad. So just need all the people, all the, the fighters, all the people that have something to, to do that, to stop this, just to stop it. Because what you see nowadays, people don't want to talk about it. Yes, yes. Big organizations, nobody wants to discuss it. And I think that's how it should start, first about talking about it so that people know something is going on because a lot of people even don't know yes that's a that's a thing so that's why such big organizations that uh, big tvs must show things like that that the people have to understand what happened to other people because all the, those people that get tortured there they yes. are, are who humans like we are so uh, it's very important for big uh, TV spot to show things like that so everybody knows and start doing things against slavery so that's why it's important tomorrow you're stepping into the ring maybe with a lot of blood sweat and tears and also pain
Are you going for the win? I think definitely, so, yes. definitely. You know what? I'm trained so long, so hard. I have to travel every day more than 100 kilometer to make power training, to make boxing training. To so all this I'm doing just for the win, just for the success. I want the people to see who I am. I'm one of the oldest glory fighter. True. And uh, all the people knows that when I'm fighting, I always go for it. Even if I win, even if I lose, I'm always show good fight in my heart. Yes. So that's what I keep wanna do. It doesn't matter what's happened tomorrow, but I will go for it. We are here with Daniel. I really yeah. like you as a sportsman because Thank I you, see well. that you're Thank you. you no really 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 Thank I you. see that you're not only thinking of yourself but also thinking of uh, humanity so I wish you the best I wish you good luck mm. um, do what you have to do and I hope within soon time we also come for an interview in your own place, in your hometown. Yes, it would be great. And then uh, we also see where you come from. <laughs> You're welcome, very welcome to come anytime. This is Fight Press, Daniel Alunga. Um, so you see, we speak English, we're doing it in Netherlands, whatever you want. Uh, Afida <laughs>